How's it going, Banjo Crew? First, I'd like to thank each and every one of you for sticking around. I apologize that we had to push the filming date back into the spring. Unfortunately, we would rather have the film be great than good. I also believe with each and every one of you involved, it will be great. Now, I'm up here at 12 Foot Falls County Park doing a little camping, and this is the birthplace of Banjo. So, I thought I'd take a second and tell everybody how Banjo came into existence. I have this buddy, um, for argument's sake, we'll just call him Jeff. I got this buddy Jeff, he's from Chicago, and uh, Jeff had never been camping before, he had never been in the woods before, but he had always wanted to go. So he was talking to me, and I decided, yeah, I can take you on a trip, and we came up here to 12 Foot Falls. And we checked out a couple waterfalls, we did some hiking, we came back to camp, made some food. Night comes and we're hanging out around the campfire and we're smoking and we're drinking and just shooting the shit. And after a few hours, my buddy, he gets tired. He said, I'm going to crawl in my tent and go to sleep. So I say, all right, well, sleep well, but remember, if you hear banjos, run. Now, he turns to me and he says, what's a banjo? And I'm just kind of stuck because I figured everybody knew what a banjo was. I, that, that, that's the whole joke if you hear banjos run. Well, he didn't know what a banjo was. And the look on my face must have stirred something inside of him because he all of a sudden got terrified. What's a banjo? Now, I'm thinking, well, what? I'm going to have some fun with this. And I just tell him, hey, don't worry about it. He usually doesn't come this far over. He usually stays the county back, so we should be fine. Wait, wait, what do you mean? Hey, Brian, what's a banjo? No, no, we're fine, don't worry about it, go to sleep. What, what is that, some kind of animal or something? No, no, we'll probably be okay, just go to sleep. He usually doesn't come over this far. Anyway, I carried this on for a couple of hours. And this guy, Jeff, he was terrified. So he didn't sleep at all that night, and I didn't tell him the truth until we got back into town. Now, Jeff has never been camping since. He will not go back in the woods. Now, fast forward a couple of months, and I'm hanging out over at Cam's house, and I'm telling Cam about what happened and Banjo and everything else. And the next thing you know, Cam puts pen to paper, and he comes up with the story of Banjo, which is the film each and every one of you are taking part in. And that is how Banjo came into existence. I thank each and every one of you once again. I appreciate you waiting until spring. I cannot wait to work with all of you. I'm looking forward to it. I'm excited. And as Cam says, this is happening.